We all know the Sahara Desert is one of the biggest deserts in the world. But what if I said I could turn this desert into the biggest forest? You won't believe me, right? That's the same thing China has done with the Three North Shelter Forest Program, turning unbelievable things into reality. This is the China's Great Green Wall. In the 1970s, China was facing a serious environmental crisis. Deserts were growing and taking over valuable farmland, and sandstorms were turning city skylines a pale, unhealthy orange. To fight this problem, the Chinese government made a brave decision in 1978. They planned to plant a huge belt of trees across the dry northern areas. This was not just about spreading seeds randomly. It was a well-thought-out project aimed at keeping the soil in place, catching every bit of rain, and bringing life back to ruined ecosystems. Over the years that followed, billions of trees have been planted, so many that if you line them up end-to-end, -end, they could circle the earth several times. Recently, state media announced a major achievement. A 3,000-kilometer greenbelt now surrounds the vast Taklamakan Desert. This landmark is a key moment in a 46-year effort to turn one of the world's toughest environments into a patchwork of green and productive land. The scale of this transformation is huge. Between 2012 and 2022 alone, official numbers show that China added 960 million diaolie mu of new forests, about 64 million hectares. In the same time, 165 million mu of grassland was improved, and over 12 million mu of wetlands were restored or created. These numbers are more than just statistics. They tell the story of millions of lives improved, entire communities revived, and nature brought back to life. People played an important role in this massive change. In 1979, China set aside March 12th as National Tree Planting Day, sparking a nationwide movement. From 1982 to 2021, citizens voluntarily planted around 78.1 billion trees. This huge effort shows the determination of a nation ready to take back its land from the desert. Innovations and impact planting trees is only part of the story. The government has also started many projects to green areas that were in danger because of desert expansion. The Three North Shelter Belt Forest Program is the star of these projects. Started in 1978 and set to be finished by 2050, this program has already protected about 31.74 million hectares of land in the northwest, north, and northeast regions. This green Great Wall not only stops deserts from spreading, but also helps prevent sandstorms, saves water and soil, and protects farmlands. Science and technology have been key to China's success. Instead of just relying on planting trees, Chinese scientists came up with clever ways to help the new forest grow strong and survive for a long time. In Minkan County, located in Gansu province between two expanding deserts, Innovative techniques like drip irrigation and building sand barriers have been put in place. These methods helped increase the area covered by forests from 11.52% in 2010 to 18.28% today. Even more impressive are methods like fish scale pits, which catch and direct rainwater to tree roots, raising tree survival rates from only 20% to as much as 80%. The benefits of turning deserts into forests go far beyond making the land look prettier. New forests act like giant sponges for carbon, absorbing millions of tons of CO2 each year and helping to fight climate change. They also reduce the frequency and strength of sandstorms, which once regularly darkened cities like Beijing and caused damage to buildings and roads. This environmental makeover has also brought economic benefits. Transforming unproductive, barren land into thriving forests and grasslands has boosted local farming and opened up opportunities for ecotourism. In many parts of northern China, these green projects have not only improved the natural surroundings, but have also helped local economies by creating new sources of income and changing the lives of people who live in areas affected by desertification. Of course, not everything has gone perfectly. In the early years, many projects used a single type of tree over large areas, a practice known as monoculture. In places where water is already scarce, these large, uniform plantations sometimes put extra pressure on local water supplies and could even, even make water shortages worse. However, China has learned from these early mistakes. 
Today, reforestation efforts focus more on using a variety of native trees that are naturally suited to the local environment. Along with better water management practices, this new approach helps ensure that the greening projects are strong and long-lasting. China's fight against desertification isn't just a domestic effort. It also plays a part in global environmental protection. The country actively meets its commitments under the United Nations Convention to combat desertification. It has even set up an international center to share knowledge and work together with other nations, especially those involved in the Belt and Road Initiative. By doing this, China not only improves its own environment, but also sets an example and offers valuable ideas for other countries facing similar challenges. China's commitment to transforming its deserts continues. The National Forestry and Grassland Administration has set clear goals. By 2025, the country aims to protect 2 million hectares of desertified land, treat more than 6 million hectares of sandy land, and manage 1.3 million hectares of rocky desert land. These ambitious plans show China's determination to build on its past success and keep fighting desertification. China's journey from a land of endless shifting sand to one filled with vibrant living forests is a powerful story of hope and determination. It shows what can happen when strong government policies, innovative science, and the hard work of millions of people come together. While challenges such as water shortages and keeping the ecosystems balanced still need careful attention, the success of the Great Green Wall and related projects offers a hopeful example for the whole world. In a time when deserts are growing and climate change threatens to disrupt ecosystems everywhere, China's efforts to turn deserts into forests stand as a reminder that even the harshest places can be transformed with bold ideas and persistent effort. The once barren expanses of northern China have become a symbol of green growth and sustainable development. This incredible transformation is not just about saving the environment, it is about changing lives. It shows how human determination can turn a crisis into an opportunity, how barren lands can be turned into productive fields, and how communities can be revitalized through nature. China's example teaches us that with clear goals, the willingness to innovate and the support of an engaged public, even the toughest environmental challenges can be overcome. As the world faces the growing threats of desertification and climate change, the lessons from China's Great Green Wall provide a roadmap for others. It is a story of human ingenuity, of nature fighting back against neglect, and of a future where even the most inhospitable lands can be made into thriving, sustainable environments.